Hey guys, just a quick video on how to clean your toaster oven. So this is a Mueller toaster oven here, and it was time to clean it. You can see inside that it's pretty dirty. It's got stuck on cheese and food. So it's pretty simple. We're gonna take the grate off here, just put it down in the sink. I've got some of that Dawn Power Wash that you spray. I'm just gonna spray that on the grate here and we'll let that sit for a minute. And next we'll go ahead and tackle the inside here. This takes the longest, but it's not too difficult. So we're gonna unplug it, of course. I like to put it next to the sink like this, where basically you can kind of sit it on its side like that, where the end or the bottom is facing the sink. We'll move the cord here to get that out of the way. And it's got a button on the bottom. And this is how you open the bottom. You just pull it down here, and that way you can get rid of the crumbs in the bottom. And that's, it's not a secret, but that's the main way you can kind of clean this here. So I just like to empty it out and go ahead and I'll use this Dawn Power Wash as well and spray this on the bottom here and let that sit. Let it do its work here. And you may need to spray it more than once here, but what I'll do is I'll just spray a little bit on here and clean off these metal um, grate protectors that protect the heating lamps here. And there's a little black spot on here. I'm gonna have to do more work to get that off. Um, the best way to get that off is probably baking soda. And I'm gonna spray the inside here. So I'm just lifting the top lid to spray the inside walls. And then we'll go ahead and tackle this here. And we'll just kind of wipe this off. Again, it may need more than one spray down, but I'll speed it up here so you don't have to sit through the whole thing, but I'm using water on the last portion of it to kind of clean off any of the chemical that would be left on there. And we're just scraping the stuck on portion. You can see there's still some left there. You can go ahead and do another round of the Dawn. I would actually do the um, a baking soda paste with a little bit of vinegar and kind of rub that on there and that would take off that, I think. so. We'll go ahead and open up the top here, and we've got that sitting on the bottom. I sprayed it with the Dawn Power Wash, and we'll just wipe this off here. And again, I'll speed it up for your sake here, and it's getting off quite a bit of stuff here. And what I like to do is I like to finish it off with water. That way I'm not leaving chemicals on the actual surface when it's heating up. It's just my preference, but... You can also clean this inside portion here. This is where the, the glass is touching the metal. And I'm just using soap and water here and that's getting that off pretty good. You can spray it again with the, with the Dawn or a Windex and it'll come off quite a bit better. So what, what you do to put this back on here, this is the bottom portion. You just take that button, clip it back in and then push it up and that locks it there. And then the next portion here, we'll clean the glass cover, just using regular Windex and some paper towels. I'm doing the outside first here, just wiping that off. And then we'll go ahead and open it up and tackle the inside. That's where you'll get most of the stains here and the streaks from the food that's kind of hit the, the glass and melted down. And then we're just going to spray off the grate here that we have in the sink that we've let sit for a minute with the Dawn on it. We'll dry that off a little bit. And we'll go ahead and put it on in here. And that's what it looks like at the end. It's not perfect, but it's better than it was. And I hope that helped a little bit. And go ahead and like the video, guys.